Alright everyone, what's good? Shadow here, back at it again, and today, the new update that came out for Dead by Daylight, where apparently it's supposed to change how some of the characters' facial and hair features work, as well as improve game performance, since the last update kind of made it worse. From previous videos, you pretty much have seen me stutter quite often, so hopefully today, uh, they fix that. And for today's build, we're just gonna run, you know, something a little simple really try to be able to vault things and be able to get away from the killer without them seeing my scratch marks uh, and to th the build consists of iron will which numbs my grunts of pain and reduces the noise it makes by 100% so I'm completely silent quick and quiet whenever I vault there's no auditory range and it could be triggered 20 seconds dance with me whenever I perform a fast vault or leave a locker in a sprint I leave no scratch marks for 3 seconds has a cooldown of 40 and life. After performing a rush vault, preferably over like a window or a pallet, I'll be able to run 150% my normal running speed for 3 seconds and has a cooldown of 40, 40 seconds. So, as I, as I said, the whole point of this build is to be able to vault things and try to make some distance on the killer. Try to get them to lose me, that'll be even better. And uh, yeah, let's do that. I'm gonna queue up for a game and I'll see you when I get into one. Underground complex. Something I just realized when loading in the game, uh, apparently you can actually use the RDP badge. So I'm assuming now the map isn't is available for all people to play. And the killer brought Hawkins. Wonder why. The doctor? Well, it's not a doctor. Definitely is a heartbeat killer. So that's something to note. Trickster, ooh, yeah. That's what I guess what I get for not reading the patch notes, but they made changes to him as well. He's supposed to be a lot better now, apparently. To be fair, Trickster did need a change. He wasn't really that strong of a killer. You can still do good with him, don't get me wrong, but... The amount of time it took for you to get laceration on him... ...and injure somebody with this power... ...was not worth it. Don't leave. He has Ruin, that's something to note. I jumped right into him. Haven't really stunned him. Yeah, so you can see there, it, there's like six bars there. That, there. It used to be eight before, now it's six. So that's pretty nice. As much as I love to be, you know, I love Iron Will and everything, I kind of don't want to be injured against him. Any killer, really. You don't want to be injured against them. Though I'm concerned where his ruin could be. Even though it's only ruin one, it still does make a huge impact. I'm gonna stop running. Like this trickster is having no problems whatsoever. Okay, they got a save. Alright, I need to do a gen. I've been pretty useless. 
as always, but I still needed to get a gen done. They're doing two of them are trying to coordinate a save. I'm gonna do this gen. No, now I'm thinking about it, who knows if it is stable as I think it is because I haven't really stuttered at all just yet But I don't want to jinx myself with that, but I might do a trickster video just see changes for myself on the Dwight. Took him a while to injure somebody. I'm gonna go in the basement real quick, check and see if I can get a med kit. That way I can at least take a hit and not go down in two seconds. Haven't really been able to use the build effectively just yet, but then again. Haven't really gotten chased too much from the killer. But it is nice though, we got a med kit. Damn. You did good, Dwight, you did good. Ow. Oh, he's got Iron Maiden. That's good to know. I'm still dead though. Bad. I should have expected it. It's a trickster main. <laughs> They're always gonna run Iron Maiden. Any range killer is gonna run Iron Maiden. That needs to reload ha their power. That is just a common fact. And I wasted my med kit for no reason. That is a serious misplay, but. Hopefully, it doesn't hurt my teammates too much. Are you really coming back? Alright. He holds on to his main event. Nice. Double down. Not putting her in basement. What are you doing? <laughs> All right, yeah. You know, what? on second thought, I think it is hurting us a lot. Don't know why you're clicking the flashlight item. <laughs> <at him. laughs> Curious to know how long you can hold the main on this though. Oh, he's here, that's why. He doesn't know. No, he does. So sometimes when I make these builds and all that, I never I never get to use it. Cuz I'm pretty sure I have yet to use light this at all this game. Why are you proxy camping me? That's what I want to know. Two people are doing a gen. I would love to get saved, but uh, I don't think it's happening here. 
White. Can you do it, man? You got it. That does kind of suck, though, the fact that I take a hit. Damn it, man. I don't have DS, so he can just straight up tunnel me. Doesn't even matter. Nobody's running BT, and that's kind of upsetting for what it is, but it's whatever. Killer makes the rules, survivors don't. <laughs> that doesn't feel bad. Oh, that's interesting. I don't know if you can notice on the side there, but there's a new way to that the sacrifice thing loads in. Yep, I figured. Wow, a twitchy. Not surprised. I literally got to do nothing that game, I'm telling you. But, let's move on to the next one. No point wandering around here for. Damn, feels bad. I even tried bringing a map offering just to get the Raccoon City map, and I couldn't even get it. Because some survivor decided to bring a sacrificial ward. So now I'm stuck playing on the Red Forest. Great. I mean, I get the idea why the Sacrificial Ward is there, just to prevent killers from getting a map that they favor. They have Corrupt, by the way. But still, it is kind of annoying, especially when I want to get the... That is the twins. Hopefully the little Victor doesn't come and find me. I can see if they have ruin. They don't. Interesting. Yeah, ruin is just very standard on most killers now. And honestly, I see why. The ability to be able to push people off of gens is pretty good on killer. And ruin just complements that idea. Baby was slaughtered. figured you'd come over here. The little baby. That hits me. Alright. Well, I'm running to one side of the map now. Well, I mean, if she's really willing to chase me all the way down here, then go right ahead, but, uh... I wouldn't really recommend it. Now, again, prefer to be healed, but iron wool is a thing. Corrupt just ran out. I'm gonna go in here for now. Curious to know she has barbecue, but I'm gonna hide in a locker and play it safe. You know what, we'll do the killer sack, Jen. Baby died. Okay, they got her up. I think she just swapped. Not sure though. Seriously, bring the baby over here? I 
think this killer's just looking to slug, to be honest. Meaning we need to heal ourselves. As I thought. We need to resituate. Just pick it up the Nia. It's fair. It's probably got barbecue. Maybe. I don't know. We will find out. We need to get those saves, though. I guess typically for twins, the whole idea would be to slug. But, uh... I'm not much of a slugger when it comes to playing killer. Unless I absolutely have to. She's upstairs. Pop goes the weasel. I'll keep that in mind. I mean, she's finally finding value out of it, so yeah. Don't worry, Nia. I'll be your savior. Would you like to heal? Oh, she has sloppy. Leave. She's gonna use the baby. Hopefully not on the Nia. But, uh, it may just happen. Yep. It's gonna happen. The only problem I have when going against twins, this literally happens. But I guess that's how you're supposed to play her. I don't play twins, so I don't know. Okay, they got each other healed. Maybe they can go for a save. I'm gonna go in the basement. I just love going in the basement, but I need to get a ch uh, get an item. Doesn't matter what it is, I need an item. Items can be game changing, depending on what it is and what quality. She has sloppy butcher. Nice. Does she go counter it? Maybe. I don't know. Might not be able to get the full heal. I might actually, I don't know. Alright, nice. We did. We don't need this anymore. Is someone gonna go for a save? Cause, uh, I healed up. She's gonna die on that hook. Yeah, she's done. And that's why I wish I had Kindred, but it's not part of the build. Not today, anyway. This killer's doing something right, though, because they're generating pressure really quickly. And... DC. Kill the baby! Use life. Gain some distance. Some distance is the key word there. Make that. Nice mind game. To eat a hit. I screwed up. Damn, feels bad. <sighs> Why do you still have the baby on you? Literally, this is how you lose now. You had all the time in the world to get the baby off of you. I don't know why you didn't get it off. This is a feels bad. I think she's being chased. She's gotta be being chased right now. I'm recovered fully. Get me up. We need to go. Victor can see the blood. 
knew that was gonna happen. Thing is, I don't think I can outrun Victor, and she's probably gonna slug him. Probably gonna slug him. I hear the child. I'm gonna do this. Get back over there as soon as possible. I hope you're recovering, because if you're not recovering, I'm screwed. Okay, you are. Good job. Are you gonna heal yourself? Or are you gonna heal me? Victor, Victor, Victor! You might have insta pounce. You charge that up real quick. Probably gonna pick me up for pressure. She's hiding in a locker. Okay. Yeah, when she leaves Victor on me, by the way, she knows where I am at all times. Don't get caught, lady. Don't get caught. I'm gonna crawl away from Victor. She's gonna be looking for him. I'm probably just gonna straight up bleed out on the ground. I don't know. Are you? Oh, there she is! Yeah. I mean, there's nothing we can really do. We really can't do anything, realistically speaking. Can't do anything. She's moving. Okay. This killer is very experienced with the twins. She's been landing those baby shots. Give her props for that. Is she gonna slug her? Yes, she is. I'm gonna let go of this gen. I'm gonna try running on the corners because I don't think Victor's really gonna be looking like that. She swapped. Yep, I knew it. As soon as I came near the radius, it was over. Damn. I didn't even realize the pallet was down. I honestly don't think she even knew Victor was there. But if she did, she should have crawled away. Yeah, this is game over. I hate it when games are played like this, but you gotta do what you gotta do as killer.
don't think she heard me. I mean, this is... I kind of don't want to give her the hook, because at the same time... But... I'm gonna bleed out anyway, so I might as well stay here like this. But, uh, yeah, this is... I guess this is the goal this killer wanted the entire time. I'm dead on the ground anyway. This is a feels bad, man. I'm not gonna lie, that, uh... Yeah, that match just... It just sucked. There's, there's literally... When this happens, when killers straight up slug, especially when it's the twins, there's not really much you can do. And I didn't want to not attempt to go for her, because, you know, it's, as survivors, you're supposed to be playing as a team. But at the same time, like, look. I mean, even though this guy DC'd, I kind of, I understand why. But, again, another video where I pretty much did not use the perks the way I wanted it to. And, I honestly think if this person didn't bring the Sacrificial Ward, the Twins are going to have a hard time on this map because it is a big map. But, you know what? She probably has her reasons and I can respect that for what it is. But, GG's. And, uh, that will conclude this video. Honestly, I don't feel like recording much more of this. So far, for the two matches I've had, I've pretty much gone against killers that, uh, let's just say needed to end the game. And did what they needed to to get out the game, and I'm not gonna, you know, hate them for it, but at the end of the day, this is Dead by Daylight. This is what it is. However, I will say that, you know, the new update, I haven't stuttered really at all. And I do like what they did with the character models, at least the facial features, and the hair. So, uh, there's that, and, uh, that concludes this. I hope y'all have a good day, and enjoy. Please like, comment, subscribe, do all that good stuff that, you know, YouTube keeps tracks of. And, uh, I'll catch y'all later in the next one. Peace.